We're Bristol Braille Technology. So our focus is on creating machines which can help reverse the decline in literacy amongst blind people, especially the decline in Braille literacy. So the Canute is a Braille e-reader. It's like a Kindle for blind people. Digital Braille does exist already. It's called, they're called Braille displays. It creates a single line of text um, and it refreshes very fast, very accurately, but it costs thousands of pounds to have this, this single line of text. So what we've come up with is an entirely new technology of our own design, very mechanical design, and it enables for the first time affordable multi-line Braille, which is what opens it up to new subjects, new mediums and so on, and makes it so much more affordable. We've been building the canoe with actually hundreds of members of the blind community Braille lists. These are people who work with Braille, read Braille, create Braille themselves. Um, and we, we couldn't have designed this machine without the input of those people. I've been involved with Bristol Braille probably for four or five years now. I remember Ed coming to see me to show me this prototype of a machine that would produce Braille in multiple lines and that has never been possible before. I come along and do some hands-on testing every now and again just to check out the hardware and make comments on the user interface and so on. This row here is definitely better. The dots are rounder and they're less abrasive, they're not sharp. Well, I'm really excited about what Ed and the team are doing at Bristol Brown because it's revolutionary. You know, it's been impossible before now to read more than one line of refreshable brow, that's brow that changes. They've sat with us and designed the user interface because without them we would be some engineers in a shed trying to fix something we don't entirely understand. So it's been very much a joint operation between Bristol Braille technology and the blind community.